good morning. Um, we're all meeting here live at the chamber. We are practicing some slight social distancing. Um, we just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about some information that we would like to share with our business community and this group that's been working very hard to do so. I'm gonna let them go around the room really quick, introduce themselves and give you a little bit of their information. And then we're gonna talk about some ideas that we have to share with you guys. It'll be very important to get out to the rest of the business community as, as a whole. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Jim Shaw from the Emergency Management Director for Lincoln County. My name is Sam Byers, and I'm the president of the Ellsbury Community Growth Association. And I'm Julie Rogers. I'm the executive director for the Lincoln County Economic Development Office. So as you can see, um, we're all working together right now for on the behalf of Lincoln County business owners. We know everyone is super concerned with the COVID-19 crisis and what that means going forward. So we have a couple of things that we wanna share with you. We're gonna be starting a joint page for joint information for the whole county, and it's gonna be called the Lincoln County Business Hub. Um, it is gonna be full of information for business pickup, store pickup, delivery, carryout options, senior citizen hours. You guys fill in if anything I'm missing. Um, just, just to share. Yeah, operations, if a business is doing something different, uh, carry out, delivery, uh, they can share that information there so that you're aware of what businesses are opening and what services they're currently offering. And we're here to serve all businesses in, all the, in Lincoln County. So mm -hmm. if you're not a member of the Greater Troy Chamber of Commerce, you're not a member of the Ellsbury Community Growth Association, it doesn't really matter. Doesn't if matter. you're a business located in Lincoln County, we want to disseminate information about your business so that we can serve you during this current time. Right. I think we all have to help each other out here and accurate and current and up-to-date information is going to be fluid. It's going to change. We're going to try to post those things into the hub as much as possible. We are going to supplement that with our weekly newsletter that goes out through the chamber, but we would like to add as many people to it as possible. If you do not currently receive that letter, you can email us. I will put the email address in this post and that way we can start sharing that through that mechanism with you guys. It'll be a centralized location for some of that same information links to resources, things that we can give to you through one, a one-stop shop, basically. Absolutely. Our businesses need to know, uh, large and small, that we are working with all of our state partners and the SBA to get as much up-to-date information as we can to provide resources to you. And we will continually post that information. And, but please don't hesitate to reach out to us. If you have immediate concerns or needs, you can contact any of us and we'll, we will see what we can do to help. Yes, we will add all of our contact information to this post. We would rather you guys reach out to us. Even if we don't have the answers, we can connect you with the appropriate authorities that do, especially with some of these, like Jim sitting behind us, we know who you can contact. Um, speaking of which, we have posted on our pages today and it will be in the newsletter today and we will share it again today that the governor did release um, some, act, some small business association lending for disaster relief loans. Um, their information is on there. I don't know if you guys wanna add to that, we just want to make sure that this gets out. Please share it. If you see any of our posts on any of our pages, please share that information. We want to get it to as many business owners as we possibly can um, to help them during these times. Yes, this qualifies. If you're simply re losing revenue, you will qualify potentially for this uh, for this assistance program. So reach out to any of us, and we will uh, connect you with the resources. Yes. So please make sure you guys. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead no. Nope. <laughs> We're all very excited. Yes, so yes. Go so ahead. later today, when you get an invitation, maybe, or you see something shared for this Lincoln County Business Hub, uh, we would encourage you to like it. What, what we're going to continue to try in our respective Facebook pages to pump information out, but we do want to create one unified source of information for everyone who lives in Lincoln County to get updates from all of the businesses and services in Lincoln County so you can have a go-to uh, source and not have to try to filter through everything. And we will try to keep it as up-to-date as possible and we will allow businesses to post their information Absolutely. so that it will continually be fluid and we want to help support those businesses as much as we can. And we'll post some tricks and tips too to try to stimulate how we can help those businesses. So your big three today are to make sure that you watch for the new Lincoln County Business Hub, like it, share it, invite people to it, um, if you want to be on our newsletter for a one-stop shop of information, please send us that email address and we will get that information posted below. And then also to follow our link for the SBA Disaster Loan Relief. I think we covered it all or? I think so. All right, guys, please, if you have questions, we would rather you reach out to us or to message us. We are available anytime. And we thank everyone for being here and making this coalition work out. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Bing. Oh, that might have been.